Welcome to day six of the Red Letter Challenge here at Lutheran Church of the Ascension in Citrus Heights. I'm Pastor Scott, and I'm glad that so far you are sticking with the challenge. Today is the first day of, of the week where we are looking at the principle about, of being. It's the first of the five principles that were introduced as part of the challenge. Being. And today we are looking at being in God's Word. The, one of the, the texts for the day comes from John chapter 8, verses 31 to 32. If you abide in my words, you are truly my disciples, and you, know, you will know the truth, and the truth will set you free. If we abide in the word of God, if the word of God becomes a part of us, we will come to know the truth of God's love for us, and that through that, we will enjoy freedom. The challenge today is to encourage us to spend time reading God's Word each and every day. And if you've made it to the sixth day of the challenge, you've demonstrated you have what it takes to start a new habit and to do something daily. When we were attending a church in the, in the early 2000s, our pastor challenged us to read the Bible every day. And then he said, I know how difficult it is to start a new um, habit, but uh, you know, if you skip a day, don't be too hard on yourself. Just begin reading again the next day. Because after all, if you hold your breath and don't breathe one breath, do you stop breathing entirely? Of course not. Or if you skip a meal, do you quit eating entirely? Of course not. So if we spend more time in God's word, we become to know God better and can fall even deeper in love with God and understand the depth of God's love for us. So just a day at a time, a little bit of time each day spent in scripture will help reveal who God is to you and deepen your understanding of God's love for you. I look forward to seeing you tomorrow in the Red Letter Challenge.